Omicron variant is spreading up and down the country, postponing football matches left, right and centre, but that won't stop us. Beyond Talks Foot here and in today's video it is Saturday we are heading down to a three o'clock kickoff in League One what you bloody love to see we are off to the very top of League One Carl Robinson's high-flying Oxford United face Wigan Athletic both sides have not lost in the league since October Wigan have not lost away from home since game week one of the League One season. Both sides are on extremely beautiful run of forms, winning three and drawing two of their last five matches in the league. And let me tell you, today, down at the Kassam Stadium, which is a new ground for me, by the way, can't wait to tick that one off. There are a lot of attacking players you should look out for. A couple on Oxford's side and a couple on Wigan's Callum Lang. Wigan man up top. He is one hell of a baller. We also saw the Wigan away fans at AFC Wimbledon just a couple of weeks ago. They were top, top class and it's a huge game for both these sides today. They must win to cement their place in and around the automatic promotion spots. My score prediction today is Oxford 1, Wigan 1. Both sides excellent will cancel out each other and it will make one hell of a football match. Let's head down to the Kassam Stadium. Here we go. Here we are, the Kassam Stadium. It's such a big game, right at the very top of League One today. Right over there, I'm sure you can see the Wigan away end filling up very, very nicely. These lot travel well, so Latix fans take a bow. We've seen a lot of them around so far. We're around half an hour before kickoff. Oh, the sex. Just seen the, there we go, yeah, top, top fans. Yeah, and there's Oxford. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Two sets of fans coming together at the very same time, about half an hour before kickoff. I've had a bit of a change of heart. I don't know why. My heart is telling me that Oxford will win this 2-1. These boys have a bit of a, a bit of a history in making history. So a win today would be so so big over a Wigan side who have some top top players. James McLean, former Premier League star, is one of their key men up top. But let's get in there. I can't wait. It's actually a famous car park we're in. Considering there's only three stands, a lot of balls every match week here come over the stand. It is very, very funny. Let's get inside. It's match day and I can't wait for it. Listen to that. Christmas tunes at Oxford United. Bloody love to see it. What a noise that is. Happy and a safe As we walk world. into the, the ground, first look, be said, we do ask you where proper nice gap, in the concourse no, no stand over there, the but possible, um, it's nice, the like it. Take one more look at this gap, take another look at the Wigan away end. And here we are, Brett, Freddie and Nathan, they're Tottenham fans, but today they're supporting their second side, Oxford. We all know Brett, he's in pretty much every video. What are we going for today, son? 1-0. 1-0. 2-0 Oxford's come on. 3-0? 2-0. 2-0, that would be huge. Nathan. I am going to go... I'm going to go 2-1 Oxford. Okay. Going to derail the Wigan Wagon. Same as me, brilliant. <laughs> come on the Ox. Look at that, Oxford Ultras. The Ultras in the North Sands. As Gaffer, Carl Robinson. Look at that. Absolutely brilliant. Fred loves it. I love it. Freddie loves it. Here come 
Wigan greeting by their travelling fans who let me tell you have brought about a thousand fans. It's brilliant! Here come Oxford! Greeting by the Oxford. Away at the Kassam. I'm not sure you can see those limbs in the away end. There's a pyro that's just gone off. Oh my goodness. I'll show you that in a second. It was Will Keane, number 10. Their main man heads the ball past Simon Eastwood. Wigan take the lead and that away end absolutely burst into unbridled joy and chaos. Wigan. Many chances to get back into that, but they fail to convert, and Wigan are in absolute dreamland. Sam Stadium, the whistle's just gone, it's Oxford 1, Wigan 2, and Nathan, sum, sum up how dirty Wigan have been in that. Yeah, they're just, every time Oxford break, they're bringing players down, which is clever, but the rest got to deal with it. Yeah, Wigan, oh, it's a great game. such a physical side, brilliant, brilliant first half, three goals. Three to Oxford. Say that again. Three to Oxford, come on. Imagine the scenes, the atmosphere has been cracking. There's been three goals, there's been Wigan limbs, there's been Oxford limbs. What more can you want in a first half of League One football? It's time to try some food, which I bloody love. Second half is on its way. We need some more goals to really make this game a that bit more interesting. What a first half that was. It wouldn't be half time at football without a cheeky food review. Toffee popcorn at Oxford. Let's chuck it. Wow. Wow, wow. Not quite a hot dog, not quite a steak pie, but that is banging. 8.5 out of 10, time for the second half. Come on, there we go. Second half is underway. Taylor, the number 
number nine makes it Oxford two, Wigan two. What an important goal that is! Maybe that scarf wasn't so lucky after all. Wigan fans sent him to absolute chaos. Oh my goodness. I don't believe what I've just witnessed. James McLean slams the ball past Simon Lee Wigan limbs off the scale. Oh my goodness. Dying embers of this one now, Wigan surely, surely have the points. And what a game it has been, let me tell you that. There we go. Those travelling Wigan fans will head home in absolute delight. Oxford 2, Wigan 3, what a game of football that was and what a top, top day those Wigan fans when James McLean scored that decisive winning goal literally three minutes from time. The chaos and carnage in that away end was second to none. So Wigan travelling fans today, take a bloody bow. You were superb, best fans in League One in my opinion. Thank you ever so much for watching today's match day vlog. It's been a cracker as always. We'll see you tomorrow back again. Good night.